Infinite Tarot 888. This message is for Libra. Now you can have Libra anywhere in your chart. And Libra, this message may resonate with you or maybe just a piece. And we're 12 seconds in and look at this. Cars ain't lying. Someone is freaking butt hurt in so much pain because they see you in this energy. Look at this, the nine of cups, your wishes being fulfilled. And here they thought you were gonna be in this energy. Now they might've left you in this energy, Libra. But look, you took the time to heal with the universe. Because look, the star card's right behind there. Libra, look at this. You found love within yourself, self-love. The two of cups. And someone is big fucking mad, hurt, feeling deserted. Now they might have left you in this position. And look, this could have been a Sagittarius trying to balance her. This is you that just, look. For a lot of you guys, this is you, Libra. This is your, look at this, your guardian angel just always protecting you. The one that got assigned for you. And look, you healed. And this is bringing justice into your life because you were loyal to God, the universe. And I'm hearing justice. It's like their plans to teach you a lesson is what I'm hearing. Backfired. And I'm hearing big time. Big time. Because look, you're in this energy. Hijos de la madre. They don't like it. They're so fucking pissed. And for a lot of you guys, Libra, they're like, why? Why does it have to be Libra that's getting these blessings? Because they didn't... <laughs> They didn't obey their, their calling. For some of you guys, the universe gave them a lot of time to right their wrongs is what I'm hearing. And look, some of, you, some of them were laughing at justice, but justice looked back at them. And it's almost like, Mary, okay, you want to play with Libra? <laughs> we're going we're gonna to make you feel what you put Libra through, baby. Two, 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 as I said that. So that, you guys might be seeing that or... Check the angel number on Google. There's a special message for you. Now, let's get into your reading because, man, you have somebody just watching you. This could be a Leo and Libra. You already know this. This could be an ex. This could be a past love. For some of you guys, very few. It could be a sibling that is just jealous on how you keep persevering, moving forward. How? How do you do this? And this particular person could want to attack you. But Libra, you're standing in your power. You know what? You trust God. Whatever comes against you, God will handle. No weapon formed against me shall prosper. And you following what? God, the universe, he's guiding you. Now, this could be man or woman, but I see a red shirt. And this is you having a passion for your spiritual journey. And someone hates it. Someone. This could be a Leo or some. Maybe you have a Leo in, in your chart. But I'm hearing someone from your past. Because it's behind you. It's looking at you. How is Libra doing this? Now this could be on vice versa. Maybe you're going through this. Shit and you're seeing somebody that you used to have a family with prosper. And you're wondering how the fuck. Did they do this? They were in this energy. A lot of you guys, Libra, didn't understand. Or whatever side of the the line you're in or the... They didn't understand why you were going through this. For a lot of you guys, you asked for help from them. You told them you were going through these difficulties spiritually. And it's almost like they left you alone. They threw you to the devil and they allowed you to be stuck with the devil. But you, they let you close these cycles alone. And the universe saw that. And for some of you guys, you're looking back and you're going, fuck, 444 as I'm saying this. Dude, this is stability. You are completing, I mean, you're surrounded by a shitload of angels is what I'm hearing. You're completely surrounded. 
and you're being guided. And it's almost like the universe told you, sit down, Libra. We got this. And this is your angels, your ancestors over here taking shots, man. They're happy that you're staying obedient and they're happy that they're able to be set free from you breaking these generational curses. And they're rewarding you with this coin for your loyalty. Look at all the knowledge you've acquired. And there you go with the red again. The red all around there. It's like you have this passion for chasing after God's heart. Put it in the comments if this is you. Because it's almost like the universe wanted you to balance. Where's this card? Balance like your your energies, your your uh where the hell did it go? I need you to balance your, your emotions. And the devil didn't want you to do that. It's almost like the devil wanted to control you, or you might be dealing, you might have been dealing with the Capricorn or still is. But this person is looking at how you're moving forward and they're freaking pissed. Now they're in this energy and they see you in total balance. Look. The number four is important because look. And they're sitting there going, damn, did I really lose my Libra? And, and, and the craziest thing is I'm here. And I'm looking back because your ancestors are like, take a shot. For some of you guys, you're about to be celebrating. And look, it says New York. So some of you guys are from New York. Or you just may be celebrating for the holidays in New York. Mm. And if you're planning a trip over there, it's almost like you're moving in confidence. You have this powerful energy that you know you can change things because of the guidance you have. And look at the confidence you see. Man or female, Tara has no gender. No matter what could be behind you, you don't care. And you feel this energy of the devil behind you. But it has no power over you. And I'm hearing God, the universe saying, they can't come with you. And it's almost like you're trusting God that they can't come with you. And you had to release. And they see you in this energy of feeling so blessed. It's almost like you trust God that he knows what's best for you. And by doing that, it's almost like you're learning that God has something always better for you. What door closes in front of you? If somebody closed that door on you, you were like, fuck, now you're you're praising God. Okay, this shit ain't working out. God, I know you have something better for me. And look at this. The universe allows you to create with him. God, the universe is like, yes, and this is you elevating to a higher level. Once you walked away from this particular person that was just trying to hold you back, look, and they're jealous watching you. And yes, it hurt to find out that they truly didn't love you for a lot of you guys. Now, let's, let's look. And they're sitting in this energy of nostalgia. I, I lost fucking Virgo. Virgo, some of you guys are dealing with the Virgo. I mean, Libra. Maybe this was a Virgo that did you wrong. Let's see. Let's check out these. It says right here, love articles. Let's see. What is this person thinking? Because I'm hearing. God says they will regret losing you. Whoo, this message is deep. They will regret losing Libra. This could be a Virgo that did you wrong. And, and Libra, you're justice. Because I hear justice. Their plans to teach you a lesson backfired. And I'm hearing big time. And I'm hearing that's major karma. It says, what do you see in me? And a lot of them are asking, like, why did you even love me? But that's, I'm hearing from your ancestors. That's a trick. They want to come back and ask you this. And a lot of you guys already moved on, Libra. For a lot of you guys, you're happy with the universe and whatever the universe has for you on your path. It's almost like, You might have not been perfect, Libra, is what I'm hearing.
But there's a blessing. There's a blessing and it has, and I'm here, freedom. Because for a lot of you guys, Libra, it's almost like you weren't perfect. But it's almost like the universe allowed you, to, it's almost like the universe was giving you signs to go back and tell your partner, your person, well, this is because of love and it triggered him. It's like you repeatedly obeyed God, go back and tell them this. And this was part of your awakening as you started to awaken and this particular person took it as a joke. And now they see you moving forward with confidence and trust in your spiritual journey. Now, baby, leave her. Hit the like button, share, subscribe, baby. Take a shot if you need to <laughs> because you're about to celebrate. But comment if this is you because you guys are grateful for the spiritual journey. And see this this demon that was back here, this lion, this could be a demon. It could be this, the devil, you know, these these entities that you might have had in, the, in your generation. You know, I'm hearing because you're breaking generational curses from generation to generation. It followed you, this entity. And you were chosen to break it. And look how much at ease you are. You're like, you know what? I, I'm not going to be afraid. You trust in God and your spiritual journey. And look, you're not scared. And fear is what? Of the devil. So some of you guys were trapped in fear. A fear of the unknown. How will I do it if I leave this particular person? If they betrayed me, if they left me on the street... You know what? You had fear and that's what was controlling you. And you're breaking free from that. And maybe you question, why do you love me? Because this particular person from your past that is watching you move away, they're not too happy. They're in this energy and they're going like, what did I do? It triggers them that you're leaving. And for a lot of you guys, they didn't want you to have this freedom. Libra, they're not understanding that you're seeking God, the universe, and they're jealous. It's almost like they want you to put them on a pedestal. But you're letting go. And you're believing in God, the universe, and you're doing that with so much confidence. And this card fell out, and it says right here, I cry at night. So some of you guys have this past person, yeah, they cry at night. They know they made the wrong decision. They be, it's almost like when they betrayed you, they betrayed God. You know, and they see you wanting out. And they're like, but I didn't understand what you were saying. And you know what? For a lot of you guys, your ancestors are saying they're full of shit. They knew what they were doing. They were warned not to harm you. And they saw you in this energy of trying to heal. For a lot of you guys, you were telling this particular person how to heal their inner child. And they laughed at you. This, this, for a lot of you guys, you guys, especially for my, my Latin people, you were trying to teach your parents about inner child healing. And they might have laughed at you. They might have discarded you. They might have counted you out. And you were there to save them all. And for a lot of you guys, they kicked you when you was down. And it's almost they allowed this energy of the devil to overcome them. And they crushed you. Let's get another one. Let's see. I got these new ones that are, they came in. Look, it's this. And... For a lot of you guys, it's freedom that you want. Put in the comments. I am financially free from my past. Freedom is my birthright. I'm hearing freedom comes to me easily and effortlessly. 14, 14 on the clock, baby. So check that out. And they're triggered because freedom does come to you as soon as you believe and trust in the universe. They hate it. They hate it. It's almost they're envious. You're going to be so happy I'm here. And grateful. <laughs> that they rejected you is what I'm hearing. You're going to be so happy. Because look, you have faith and love. And it's coming. Love is coming. Surprise invitation. And this could be from a, a person that is lighthearted. And 
things come into light. It's almost like you're understanding love, but you have a surprise invitation. And look, it says teddy bear interested in you. There's a particular person, Libra, that is interested in you and they want to flirt. They want to date you. So you have that coming in the future. And the universe is telling, is, is trying to remind you that God has someone better for you, something better for you. So they want you to stay focused on God, God's plan for you, or God's guidance, and your healing. And I'm hearing your, your divine purpose. These cards fell out. All of these came out. It's almost like the universe wants you to cut out the bullshit that no longer resonates with you. Yes, it may trigger a lot of people from your past, but the universe is asking you to cut out what no longer resonates. It says right here, cutting, sep stopping a pattern, silent treatment. But I'm here stopping a pattern, and that's generational curse, baby. And it may trigger you, even your family. And it's going to be because you suddenly changed and they don't like this and it triggers them. But guess what? It's going to push them into self-reflection. You're going to mirror this and it's going to help them heal is what I'm hearing. Now, you do have the poker face. For some of you guys, you're taking that chance. You're taking that risk. <laughs> you're not going to show your hand on which way you're going. That's why... Look, this card came out. They're steadily spying on you, Libra. Wanting to know what you're doing, which direction you're going, and how the fuck are you doing it? Period. For a lot of you guys, they're like, why does God love you so much? <laughs> is what I'm hearing. And baby, it's just God just loves you. Put it in the comments. Claim that energy. God loves me and is always for me. And it's always protected me. And they hate that. They hate it. Look at them. They want to devour you. <laughs> so a lot of you guys, the universe is asking you to stop being angry of the situation, of your past. It's, it's, it's almost like the universe released you from, um, from a person that might have been abusing you financially or just taking advantage of you. And you... Like I heard earlier, you might have not been perfect and no one's perfect but God, Jesus. You know, no one. No one is perfect but God. Now, we're perfect in God's eyes. But I'm hearing this particular person was hurting you purposely. Like to try to teach you a lesson and that wasn't their job. That's God's job to teach you a lesson. And it's almost like right now you have this protection. And I just heard when I saw this, not now, Satan. Not now, not today, Satan. And it's almost like you have your boundaries up. And man or female, you're not trusting this particular person. You already saw, for, saw them for who they really are. And they've got to heal. Then they see you healing. But for a lot of you guys, you've already healed from heartbreak. And you're not going to let them in. And it's almost the universe is going to block them. So for a lot of you guys, I'm here in Psalms 37, 8. Some of you guys could be 37 or born on the 8th. But they want you to stop being angry. There's something amazing. And it has to do with freedom. So let's see. What do we have for this one? They want me to use this right here. For Libra, Sun, Moon, Rise, and Venus, anywhere in your chart. Hit the like button. Share. Subscribe. Take a shot. I don't know, but hey, responsibly. So let's see. Some of you guys are seeing 1111, 666. Y'all saw this card fly? And it says right here. Instead of you, instead of worrying about the future, I now, I know all is well when I'm aligned in the moment. Now, let me read it again because it wasn't coming out right. It says, instead of you worrying about the future, I know all is well when I'm aligned in the moment. Look, this is your advice from the universe. And it's almost like you trusting in God. And I see this in this card that came out. Libra, no matter what, your justice 
anybody that does you wrong, you will be isolated. And it's you're not afraid to be alone with God. And this is you walking in faith, not by sight. But the universe is telling you, instead of worrying, give your worries to God. Enjoy your present. It says, I am an owl of the magnificent guidance that's available to me. This is when you take your power back. This is when you took your power back in the past. And a lot of you guys, I keep hearing it right now. Your testimony is very important because even in the dark, the universe, God allowed you to prosper in this darkness. And this was a test that you freaking passed. The devil wanted to trap you. Look, these cards don't lie. The devil wanted to trap you, keep you in this energy. And you thrived in this darkness. Your crown chakra, your third eye was beaming, but your heart was open to love no matter how hard shit was and that's why you're receiving major blessings wow so that's what i have for you libra sun moon rising anywhere you chart hit the like button share subscribe and comment if this is you put it here i am freaking blessed yes apart from you being gorgeous because you can put it i am freaking gorgeous but you're moving forward with confidence and you know what Jim and I had the same message, or it was Pisces. It's almost like you guys are moving with confidence. Nothing can stop you. You have angels of protection all around you. Believe it. Trust it. Infinite Tarot 888.